The scripture reading for today's Lenten devotional is Joshua chapter 4, verses 14 through 24, which says in part, In these days to come, when your children ask their fathers, What are these stones doing here? Tell your children this. Israel crossed over this Jordan on dry ground. The following reflection was written by Pastor Tan Mayhall, Grandview UMC, Southwestern District. Transitions. I'm writing this in the early November when the trees are ablaze with the yellows, oranges, and reds of fall. You are reading this in late March when spring blossoms have already filled the woods with signs of new life. Fall and spring are both transition periods moving from one season to another. Today's reading from Joshua describes a transition time for the people of Israel. After 40 years of wandering in wilderness, they were finally they were finally realizing the promise as they crossed the Jordan to enter in Canaan. We are often in transition as well, moving from loneliest to relationship or relationship to loneliness. Moving from dreams to reality, from searching to employment, or from security to uncertainty. What tra transitions are you facing today? The people of Israel stopped to make a monument to God's mighty act in parting the Jordan as a reminder that their hope lay in God alone, not in their efforts. They, there are many, there may be a temptation in this Lenten season of representatives to try to make ourselves feel so sorrowful for Christ, Christ's suffering that in a way we deserve forgiveness, but the mighty act in God's alone we receive God's grace undeserved. Thanks be to God. Count yourself lucky how happy you must be. You get a fresh start. Psalms 31 through 1. Let us pray. Steadfast God, you call to mind your mighty acts of grace that make the transitions of my life. Grow my trust that you are now even at work. Amen.